constitutional rights lawyer Bob Oke Okoroji Esquire has blasted the Nigerian chief of army staff, General Taku Yusuf Butai, over his recent comment on declaring state of emergency in the southeast if any security officer is attacked in the region. Okoroji, infuriated by the comment, which he described as most ignorant and irresponsible, said, he said the comment, the comment was in total disregarded for the rule of law with far-reaching national security implications. The constitutional lawyer, in a reply to the army uh, chief, said declaration of a state of emergency in the state was grounded on actual public order, concern, safety and security, and not on an imagery speculative and to threat to public order. According to him, Botai wanted to usurp and to arrogate to himself the constitutional powers of President of Nigeria, but had inadvertently reviewed his inordinate ambition to illegally adjust and seek presidential powers or even take over government from President Muhammad Buhari. There are circumstances and conditions that can warrant the imposition of the state of emergency in Nigeria or any part of it thereof, which Botai appears to be totally ignorant of. In Section 305 of 1999 Constitution, the Constitution states the procedure of declaration of the state of emergency, who may declare it, the circumstances and condition that we warrant such a declaration when it will seek to have effect and the respective rules of the National Assembly, state governors and the state legislative house in the process. Let me make haste to state that under our law, the power to declare state of emergency in Nigeria or any part thereof lies not with the chief of army staff or any ex for that matter appointed or elected but power to declare some exclusive lies with president of the federation such to subject to national assembly two or three majority approval certainly not with a may chief of army staff by his own military fleet through the media section 305 3 in bracket states clearly that the proclamation of emergency shall be made by the president under the following conditions when number one nigeria is at war two nigeria is in imminent danger of invention or involvement in a state of war number three there is actual breakdown of public order and public safety in the federation or any part thereof that requires extraordinary measures to restore peace and security. Others are, there is a clear and present danger of an actual breakdown of public order and public safety in the Federation or any part thereof, requiring, requiring extraordinary action to avert such danger. There is an occurrence of imminent danger or disaster or natural calamity affecting the community or a session of the community in the Federation, among others. Recalling how past presidents and uh, heads of state once declared state of emergency at some point and part of Nigeria, the constitutional lawyer regretted that Mr. Butai, a mayor appointee, an errand boy of the president of Nigeria, could utter such words. Therefore, the point must be underscored that under the current constitution, it is president of the federation and not chief of army staff that has the power and authority to declare a state of emergency, which the president cannot even do without the express approval of two or three of national assembly. So, the presidential proclamation must still be subjected to the ultimate approval of the National Assembly 
for the declaration to be lawful and valid. The reported statement of the Chief of Army Staff, Mr. Butai, about his plan to impose a state of emergency in Southeast uh, geopolitical zone, therefore, is unwarranted. He said Southeast remains one of the uh, peaceful regions, therefore, making Butai's arrogant uh, comment and blunt show first against unharmed uh, civilians. Additional, this is additional threat also to the people. He said Butai obviously holds the Southeast in great contempt. So he seeks to uh, intimidate and wage unnecessary um, war against the government and people of Southeast and South South because to him, the two regions appear to be soft targets, he said. Wow. Hello, guys. What's your view on this? As you can see. Anyway, so many Nigerians have been shouting that... Uh, in the situation in Southeast have not so warranted a uh, state of emergency. Why some persons say that uh, they have issues on ground in uh, Southeast where they have Boko Haram's and Fulani men, terrorists all over the place, feasting and dining together. Okay, that the the chief of uh, army staff of Nigeria should go there and declare state of emergency. All right, someone said the Southeast don't over suffer since this unfortunate government come into power. Okay, someone said Bhutan mission is to conquer the South for the fuller needs. If not, let him declare state of emergency in Sokoto because two police officers were killed by bandits. Okay, go and force Boko Haram in not in not, he said. Okay, someone said that he should be released removed now as his body language is enough to let us know where he is uh, heading to this man will overthrow this government if not removed now his statement clearly showed that he hates south south and southeast is blood tasty butai explaining butai is really wicked hello guys there are so many reactions here but this is the uh, Lista can go for now. What's your view on this? Kindly leave your opinion below the comment box. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to share. Thank you very much.